Buying a gift for a family member or friend who plays golf can be a tricky task, especially if you don't play golf. So what we've come to do in this video is look at some of the best golf gift ideas that we think you can get for a family member or a friend. Uh, I'm here with Joel. How are we gonna structure this video and how are we gonna present these gifts? So we're gonna break it down into three different categories, Dan, depending on kind of your budget. So 25 pounds and under, then 25 pounds to 75 pounds, and then 75 pounds or over if you're feeling especially generous. Uh, to give them an extra special gift. So as you can see, we've got a lot of gifts in front of us we're gonna talk through, and uh, hopefully you'll have some inspiration if you are looking to buy a friend or a family member a golf gift, maybe for Christmas or another event, this is the, the type of thing you need to consider. Right, so now the first category within our golf gift ideas video, 25 pounds and under, I'd say an ideal stocking filler, potentially for someone, maybe for Christmas. What have you gone for within this category? You're allowed to pick two. Two, so I've got two gift ideas. My first gift idea, which I have two examples of here, is a good golf book. Uh, I got these both for under 25 pound on Amazon. Uh, nice coffee table books, you know, decent reads as well, both of them, I have read both of them myself. And I think a golf present uh, needs to be something that's quite useful as well. And for under 25 pounds, a stocking filler, Secret Santa maybe, I think they'll really appreciate that. Uh, my second option is here, is this Champ Key chipping net. I got this for 23.99 on Amazon and it comes with 12 foam golf balls as well. So this is great for practicing outdoors or indoors with these foam balls uh, if the weather turns. Um, and what's better than a gift of better golf? Hopefully the person you give this to will get a bit better at chipping while using this. And it's, it's a good net as well. You can, you can find some flimsy ones on Amazon, but I've tried this myself. It's a pretty good net. Excellent choice. And my first choice within this category kind of ties in quite nicely it with It will complement this net. lovely, yeah. Absolutely. It's the, the golfer's club chip and drive map costs $14.99. So basically, if you want to practice your chipping, but you don't want to take huge divots out of your lawn, this is an excellent option. It's got a nice kind of artificial grass map, which you can obviously chip off. It's quite heavy, which is good. It's not going to move around when you're chipping off it. It does have a tee as well. So if you have got a bigger net, uh, you want to hit driver off it, you can do that. So it's pretty versatile. Um, and for $14.99, I think, is a, is a good option yeah. to save the, the integrity of your lawn. Yeah. The other option that I've gone for is a FootJoy glove. Um, I think a, gl a premium leather glove is a gift that golfers love to receive. They don't necessarily want to buy them themselves, like Spot to save on. a bit of money, yeah. but it's nice to receive a premium glove. Definitely. This Hyperflex one costs £18, so more towards the top-ish end of, of gloves, but it does give you that excellent all-round performance of grip, really nice soft feel, a really nice fit as well, and it's nice and breathable. So if you're looking for like a nice premium glove that you want to gift to someone else, Forge Your Hyperflex glove is an excellent option. Right, Joel, the next category is £25. £75, a gift for someone you obviously quite like. This is a decent amount of money to spend. So we've got some good ideas here. Uh, kick us off with a few. Yeah, I've got three, actually. Oh, I'm breaking okay. the rules a little bit, but mm. you know we can all do with more gift ideas. And the first one is a Golf Monthly subscription. A shameless plug. Yeah, very on brand. Monthly, no, I like it. I think you do get quite a good value with a Golf Monthly subscription. So uh, you can get three, -ish, three issues for £5 then every six issues after that is £22.49. So essentially you can get 15 issues of Golf Monthly for just under 50 quid, which I think is an excellent present it's idea. It's a gift that keeps on giving as well. It is, you it's know, everlasting. everlasting it's, it's almost gifts. perpetual in that Pretty you much. Know, you, every month it'll just come through your letterbox and um, you get a lot of entertainment from it. Absolutely, so oh yeah. That's my first gift idea. The second one I would go for is, this is a Champ Key Golf Swing Trainer. And I think this is one of the best training aids you can buy Definitely. on the market because the benefits there's so many different benefits in terms of but i think there's four key reasons why i think golfers should use this something like this a lot more so the first one obviously it's a bit of basically it's like a, a wobbly heavier kind of golf club style training aid and because it's heavier you can warm up with it so if you're like just when you get to the course have a few swings with it loosen your body your muscles up like that um, the second benefit of it is that it helps your timing so you can't snatch at the golf ball with this because it just won't work properly. You have to kind of wait for it. So it gives you really good timing in your transition. It also helps with your swing plane. So if you're a golfer who swings and then throws over the top because it's weighted, you'll naturally almost shallow it and drop it more on the inside. So it gives you a really good uh, kind of feedback on your swing plane. And the fourth one I think is just tempo. It gives you a much better kind of sequencing and just a much better tempo helping you get that kind of speed at the bottom of the swing rather than having the speed too early in your swing where you're throwing the club head and things like that. So excellent option, cost $44.99. So one of the less expensive versions of this type of training yeah. you can buy. 
so we'd thoroughly recommend it. I don't know how it would fit in the stocking, you'd have a bit of a problem bit with it. Bit of an issue with the stocking, but yeah. I think it's one of those things that not enough golfers have, so I wouldn't worry about whoever you're buying this for already having it. I don't think enough people do already, and they just keep it in the golf bag with your clubs, carry it around with you as well, I think. It's a great good, option. Very good point. And just quickly, my last one would be some, some uh, PRG head covers. So these are some Ryder Cup ones I got sent. Uh, these cost uh, £40 each, and these were actually the ones that the players were then actually using nice. uh, at Whistling Straits. Obviously, you don't have to get Ryder Cup style head covers, PRG do a whole host of different designs, but having a novelty head cover, something a little bit different, something a bit unique, I think just makes your golf bag stand out a little bit more, adds a bit of personality to your golf bag, and uh, these Ryder Cup ones I think uh, are excellent, and the quality is really good as well. So, PRG head covers, that was my final choice, 40 quid. What are you going for, Dan, in this price category? Uh, I've got, got the two, stuck to the rules. Um, I've gone, this is a pretty basic one, to be honest, which is a dozen balls. I've got uh, the Pro B1X here, but again, with the golf glove that you said earlier in the slightly cheaper price category, it's the kind of thing you don't want to buy for yourself. You'd love to get it gifted. Uh, the Pro V1 and Pro V1X are the best balls on the market. I think we're, we're in agreement on that. Uh, these cost just under £50 RRP. But, you know, if it is Christmas, you'll see a lot of companies doing deals, two for 50 perhaps, to get two dozen balls. And a lot of companies will also do personalization, uh, often for free as well. Obviously, you buy the balls, but it's free on top. So you can put their initials or a fun message, and that's a nice way to personalize a gift at Christmas. Uh, my second option in the 25 to 75 pound category is a polo shirt. I've got a nice uh, Footjoy polo shirt here. This is 55 pounds, so the top end of a, of a polo, but it's a very good one, so it's worth it. And again, if it's Christmas, often uh, retailers or pro shops will do little bundles. And you can't go wrong with clothing, I don't think. Um, you can never have too much. If you don't quite know what to get them in the clothing, I recommend getting a pro shop voucher, something to support your local pro, and they can go and buy it themselves at their leisure. Well, Dan, I would say we've picked some excellent gift ideas so Absolutely. far, given people a lot of inspiration. But before we head into that final premium category, let's talk through some of the pitfalls, some of the things that golfers or people buying for golfers should really avoid. What would, what would you say are things that people should definitely not buy as a golf gift? Yeah, and there's plenty out there that you'd want to avoid. Uh, for me, a novelty golf ball, one of the ones that explodes. Um, the emoji golf balls, you'll see lots of them. You're never actually going to use them. It's not, even, it's not really that funny either. Um, so I wouldn't go for any kind of novelty golf ball. I did mention a proper golf ball is a great gift. Um, an accessory set, you can often get nine in one sets you know, with, with a pitch mark repair at a ball marker. These are obviously, obviously often pretty cheap and the person you're buying for will probably already have a ball marker, a pitch mark repairer. So ignore that. And the final one for me is a ball retriever. Because what, what are you saying about your mate or family member there that you need a ball retriever? It's not the kind of thing you want in the bag. Uh, it might save them some money because they might retrieve their ball, but I wouldn't want that bought for me personally. So those are my three that I would, I would definitely avoid. Good, good shouts. Yeah, I mean, for me, I think, again, those sorts of really novelty gifts are like a, a golf-related pen set I remember I got once, which was just absolutely shocking. <laughs> Obviously, those mats that you putt with on the toilet, definitely avoid those sorts of things. And the last one would be any sort of golf-themed tie. I've seen a few of them online, they're absolutely shocking. Yeah, then they're not. You don't need people, to, if you play golf, you don't really want to shout about, shout about it at a formal event no. with a tie. No. So just the stuff like that, you know, anything, maybe clothing, if you buy it in the wrong size, that's obviously a no-go. So make sure you check your size. I know you picked your foot joystick. That's a good point, yeah. Support. Make sure you go for the right size and avoid anything tacky. I think if you're a serious golfer, you're not going to want to receive those things. But anyway, moving on. Let me throw to you first to talk through these these top price items. So something I would guess it's, it's your partner. Yeah. So, so there's a lot of ladies watching buying for their partner. You know what sorts of things if you want to splash out, can they can they invest in? Yeah, this was fun picking this because I thought, what would I want to get? For quite expensive. My first one is the putt out set. So what I've got here, this is the premium putt out trainer. I've got. Uh, you can get what's called the travel bundle, which comes with one of these devices as well as the putting mat and a mirror. I think this is great for Christmas. Um, for example, Christmas morning, it's good fun with everybody to have a go with this. And it's the gift you can keep adding to. So put out, uh, supply different mirror sets, uh, gate alignments, alignment sticks. So it's the kind of thing as well that you can keep adding to uh, through birthdays, through various other holidays that you can give to them. So this could give you gift ideas for quite a while. Uh, so that set there is $99.99. Uh, my final, uh, well, my, the most expensive one, uh, is the Golf Buddy Laser Light. Now I think this is the kind of thing a lot of golfers aspire to have, a laser. Uh, this comes in at £129 on Amazon, I believe, which is on the low end for a laser, but it still does everything a laser needs to do. Um, it's accurate within one yard. It's got slope on it as well, so you can read how high or low the pin is. 
and I think it's a, a very aspirational gift for a golfer, a very good one, comes in a nice carry case as well, and I think a very good premium gift. So the Golf Buddy Laser Light is, is my top premium option. Uh, Joel, what have you gone for in the premium category? So I've broken the rules again and I've picked yeah. three gift ideas for something a bit extra special. So the first one would be Arcos Caddy sensors. So I have them in the tops of my grips. You can see here, they just screw in the top. And these basically in the background will track your shot locations and, and then partnering with the Arcos app give you really good insights into like your performance and how you play, where your strengths and weaknesses are. So, it's a really good gift for a gadget lover who is serious about their game, they want to improve. This will give them the feedback and to allow them to do that. It comes in £169.99 for the sensors. You can add to it, as you've mentioned, with other devices like yeah. the Link and other things uh, to make it a bit more easy. But that's a really good option uh, to try. My second one would be the Garmin Approach S12 watch, one of the cheaper GPS watches on the market. Really streamlined design, really easy to use, gives you all the information you need. Um, so if you're looking to, to gift them a distance measuring device, that would be definitely one I would recommend. And my final um, gift idea, now this is very much top end oh, in yeah. terms of premium pricing. I think, I think you like this person if you're getting in this, <laughs> you but really it's, a great, it's a good idea still. Yeah, I mean, you, you have to like them a lot. And if money is no object, if you're looking to really treat them, um, I would think about buying them a Rapsodo mobile launch monitor. This is, um, it's, a, it's a growing trend, I would yeah. say, in, in, in golf and for, with golfers looking to get more feedback on their play. Uh, it comes in at £549, so it is a lot of money. It, it, it pairs with your phone, so essentially it's a, it's a mini launch one. So it'll, it'll tell you your ball speed, your launch angle, and it'll predict your carry distances as well. So it's really easy to use. Um, I've, I've really enjoyed using it to get that feedback on how far you think your club is really important. So if you haven't got that, um, would thoroughly recommend giving it a try. Uh, the Rapsodo Mobile Launch one at uh, £549. So that concludes our look at the uh, golf gift ideas. I think we've given, hopefully we've given you some really good ideas at different price points to buy for your friends and family if you're looking for to treat them with something extra special. We've got a nice selection of different options here um, to, to give them something very special. What do you reckon, Dan? I think we've done well here. I think we've covered all bases. Avoid those novelty ones we suggested. I think if you avoid them, find something here in your price bracket or something similar, uh, you'll do a great job. So that's all from us from Burley Park Golf Club here in Stanford. We'll see you next time.